Hey, what up guys? It's Halloween and today we have another manga haul. Alright, so let's go ahead and get right into it. Let's just start with this stack since you can already see it. This is from a seller on eBay where I buy a lot of my 7 Cs titles from. So, let's get started with that. We had Railgun Volume 6. I got all these Railgun Volumes for $35. So, yeah, that was really lucky. Especially this one right here. Man, I've been searching for about 5 months for this volume. And finally it was on there. But heck yeah. And now most of these volumes are out of print. So, <laughs> yeah, there's that. Thanks Seven Cs for that. Um, if you know about them, they've really, man, a lot of their volumes go out of print pretty fast. Volume 10. And some of these volumes, man, they're, they're pretty thick, man. 11. And I'm almost up to date on this as well. 12. It's just got a little damaged corner right there, but I mean... Really, that's not that bad. And the final volume 13 that I have from there right now. I believe volume 15 is out in the U.S. right now. I'm not too worried about that going out of print because that one literally just came out. So, yeah. All right, let's go with this stack next. Picked up Twin Star Exorcist volume 8. If y'all haven't been checking this out, man, y'all are missing out. 9... I mean, the artwork is just phenomenal. 10. And volume 11. And this next volume I'm about to show y'all, I found at my local bookstore. I don't know if I'm going to collect the series. I would like to, but it goes like for $1,100 plus dollars on eBay right now. So... If I can find more volumes of it, I'll collect it. If not, I might just sell this one. I don't know. I have Mushishi Volume 7 in really, really good condition. I mean, it's basically like new. Yeah. Then I picked up My Hero Academia Vigilantes Volume 2. Demon Slayer Volume 18. God. I love this series. I haven't read it on the app. I'm just reading it whenever the physical volume comes out. And man, uh, I didn't want to hop on like the hype train of Demon Slayer, but it honestly is just so damn good. And then Rent a Girlfriend Volume 3. Absolutely love this series. I'm holding off on watching the anime because I know it goes further than the manga that's currently released in the u.s but yeah if y'all haven't checked out rent a girlfriend please do so okay let's start with this one right here because since you can already see i bought my first junji ito horror book book um yeah it's venus in the flytrap i was looking to get into junji ito and some of my friends and other people requested that i try this one out so, as soon as I'm done with what I'm currently reading, I'm going to hop over here and read this. But yeah, I do like that it's a hardback and everything. Picked up Volume 10 of Defrag. It's got a little crease on it right here. Not too bad, but it's definitely there. And then I picked up from a local bookstore some out-of-print volumes of Hyatt, The Combat Butler. I'm trying to get into the series. There's only two more volumes I need that are out-of-print, and then I can really start collecting it. But yeah, so I got volume four right here. Volume six. And volume seven. And then I decided I want to try and read some more Berserk and stuff like that. So I picked up volume three. Once I get about five volumes or something like that, then I'll start actually reading it. I mean, I really like this cover. But, yeah, all I hear is good things about Berserk. 
Next up is a set that I have currently ordered for Christmas haul. So this set will be complete in the next video because I already have volume 11 of it, which is the only out of print volume. But yeah, I got Neuro Rise of the Yokai Clan. There's volume six. Seven, I also really, really love the artwork in this as well. Eight. Nine. Ten. I would suggest people pick up this series. I mean, if you're going to read on the show and jump out, that's a good idea. But if you cannot find volume 11, you're, man, it's going to be hard to collect this full set physically. And then I picked up some Kaguya-sama. Volume 8. 9, which is a thick boy. 10. 11. And volume 12. I know there's more of it out there. I just wanted to pick up to about this. Um, right Stuff did recently jump their shipping prices up. So instead of free shipping for $50, it's now $75. So that's where some of this came from. But yeah, um, that's all that I picked up this month. I have a decent sized haul coming up <laughs> for Christmas. So stick around for that. Other than that, if y'all have any suggestions or anything like that for any manga I should be looking into, please leave a comment down below. Um, I also am having a lot of big preparations for 2021. Some other stuff we might be getting into. Some gaming, not like Call of Duty type gaming like I do on my live streams and stuff like that, but like actual anime games like Sword Art, um, the My Hero Academia one, maybe some Dragon Ball Z fighter. We'll just see what's going on. But yeah, so stick around for all that. Like I said, if you have any comments or suggestions for any manga I should be picking up, please leave them down in the comments and I'll check it out. Bye.